Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you six ways that you can wear a Masana scarf. I don't know about you, but I love shopping at thrift stores for vintage scarves, but my favorite scarf probably has to be the Masana scarf. Masana is a Navajo word and it translates to grandma. And because these scarves have been long worn by our beloved grandmas, they have earned the name Masana scarf. Today, they are widely popular among native people who find creative ways on how to incorporate it into their outfits. Now that you know the backstory to the Masena scarf, let's get into this video where I show you six ways on how to style this scarf. For this first look, we will be using two Masena scarves. With the first scarf already folded in half, fold it in half again. From here, fold four more times to make a narrow rectangle. Set this aside for now. With the second scarf already folded in half, fold it into thirds like so. Lay the bigger scarf over the smaller one. You are now going to tie a bow around the white scarf with the fuchsia one. Keep adjusting the bow to your liking. I am just pulling at it here to give the bow more volume and that is it. To secure this top, just tie it in the back and make sure to hide the ends by tucking them underneath. So here is the final look. Isn't it cute? I love an oversized bow and I wanted to come up with a top that was different from what I've seen before and this hits the nail on the head for me. This looks great worn over a simple t-shirt, but I also think this could be worn over a strapless dress too. There are so many possibilities on how to style this bow top, so just have fun! For the second look, we are making a corset type belt. Start with your scarf folded in half. Fold the top corner over a little and then fold that in half. You can adjust the thickness to fit your waist, so just play around with it. From here, you are going to wrap the scarf around your waist like so and tie it in the back. Make sure to tuck the ends so they don't show. And that's it for look number 2. Simple, right? This corset belt does an amazing job of defining your waist so that you have an hourglass figure. This is something that I would wear with a t-shirt dress or an oversized top to really accentuate the waist. Lately, I've seen very creative ways of people wearing a corset as part of their outfit. I've always wanted to try this trend out, so here's my personal twist on it. I love how it turned out. For this look, we are making another bow. With your scarf folded in half, fold it in half again and then into fours. From here, you are going to pull the scarf through your front belt loop. I always make one end a little longer than the other. This way, when I finish tying the bow, the ends are even. With the shorter side, make a loop. With the longer side, go around that loop and pull through to make the bow. Adjust it to your liking. And there you have it, the perfect accessory to any outfit. If you want to wear this on a dress or pants with no loops, you can tie this onto a belt instead. This is the perfect way to dress up a basic t-shirt and jeans outfit. This look is probably the most simplest and most worn. All you need to do is fold your scarf in half so that it is triangular like this and then fold over the straight side a little bit. This makes a scarf top and all you have to do is secure it in the back by tying. I think this top looks better when the scarf hits just below your waist, so that is why I shortened it when folding. 
With spring and summer coming around, this colorful floral print will be the perfect piece to wear, especially since it's open in the back. To really make this top stand out, pair it with some white denim jeans. For this next look, all you have to do is tuck in the bottom half of the scarf so that it is straight across. Now we have transformed this into a bandeau top. I recommend wearing this with high-waisted jeans or trousers for a chic look. You can even pair a matching blazer with it as well. For the final look, take your scarf folded in half and then fold it into thirds. This should match the thickness of the bandeau top from before. We are going to be placing this over the bandeau top to create an asymmetrical look. Place it across your chest like this and wrap it around so that the ends meet around your shoulder. Tie it in place and you are done! I have been obsessed with asymmetrical tops lately. They are so eye-catching in my opinion. If you have two of the same colored scarves, you can use that to create this top, or you can mix and match different colors like I did here. I had so much fun creating these looks for you all. I would love to see how you would style them. Please tag me on Instagram at Me so I can see your Masena scarf outfits. As always, thank you so much for watching. Please let me know down in the comments which look was your favorite out of all six. Also, don't forget to like this video and also subscribe to my channel. And I hope you have a nejonaful day.